Hey there Living Jets Headers, welcome to yet another flight review. Well today I'm at the beautiful Indira Gandhi International Airport here in Delhi and I'm flying on Air India on their Dreamliner that is their 787 from Delhi to Dubai. So join me on this adventure as we review how good is Air India in 2024. Now the check-in process was pretty smooth, they had separate lines for their gold members, loyalty members and also for business class and economy and also your web check-in uh, people. So it hardly took me 5 minutes to check in, uh, so great service at the ground level so far. Uh, we made ourselves to the gate and we are waiting for boarding, so let's see how the boarding process is and we'll get back to you on board uh, Air India's uh, 787 Dreamliner. Now our aircraft for today is a Boeing 787-8 and it's been in Air India's fleet since 10.3 years. So it is pretty old. Um, let's see how is it on board and uh, as we all know that Air India has definitely placed a lot of orders for new aircraft and I think the deliveries are slow to happen but once it happens I think Air India should be a force to reckon with but nonetheless let's see how is it let's experience Air India's hospitality this time on uh, the economic class uh, from uh, Delhi to Dubai so boarding has begun and pleasantly surprised to see Air India do it right hi good evening So our seat is 27A, so the configuration is into a 333 in the economy segment. So this is our seat for the moment, looks like a very well kept aircraft. So welcome on board Air India's Dreamliner uh, 787 to Dubai. Let me quickly give you guys a seat review. So starting first with the seat recline. Quite a very good decent seat recline, in fact I'm pretty impressed with it. Let's check out the headrest, a nice foldable headrest, yeah, so that's good. At the seat you already have a pillow. The legroom is quite decent, so that's quite good. You have like a nice footrest also down. Well, 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 this seems to have a broken system on board here, yeah, yeah, the remote. So that's not good and looks like the IFE is not turned down or not working so tone seat covers which is not good. Mm, let's check out. Like I said it's an old aircraft so it seems pretty outdated like even the magazines are not very well capped and there are stains on the seats. There's a, there are headphones here. Well, I hope the IFE works for that to try it out. Let's check out the tray table. And uh, stains dirty, unkept. A uh, lot of stains. So, very poor hygiene. Well, that's about the seat review on Air India 787. Broken down, stains, dirty. Well, Air India has to improve on this. And I'm just looking across, I think this is the guy in need of the R. I, I saw another seat with a broken down iron the socket for the remote. One thing I would like to say, the cabin crew seems extremely friendly and very nice. Even we got a nice warm welcome when we entered the aircraft and even now when the cabin crew was passing by, she gave a smile, so which is very nice. So I'm still waiting to review the IFE and as I can see, uh, some of the entertainment screens are working for some passengers and not working for some. So I cannot give you the review of the IFE on board the 787. So we have an on-time pushback, in fact a before time uh, pushback. service has begun and I've opted for the vegetarian meal today so let's see what's on board. 
Well, this looks like some rice with some potatoes and some cauliflower. And I think that's some paneer gravy. For dessert, you have some chocolate mousse. Uh, salad, you have some corn with uh, lime, cucumber and some tomatoes. And you get some bread with some butter, some yogurt and some oranges. Let's dig in. So I'm going to try the salad first. Pretty good salad. Alright, let's try the mains now. Well, that was an excellent meal. Thoroughly enjoyed it. And uh, one thing I can definitely say with um, surety is that Air India has upped its game on its meal service. Excellent food. Hey guys, welcome to the washroom review on board Air India 787 Dreamliner. Well, first impression when I walked in the washroom itself, it's very outdated. And let me quickly show you around. So basically no amenities. And it's just been like half an hour into the flight and it's already 30. As you can see. They had, there is a bassinet here. Some soap. And I don't think there's even tissue papers available. So not well kept. Well there's a air freshener which doesn't seem to be working. But you can see that this aircraft is really old. Well, that's about it. Uh, I think uh, Air India really needs to upgrade its aircrafts, refurbish them. That's all we have from the washroom review here. Well, as you can see, a few lucky passengers have the entertainment screens working, and a few do not. Well, with <clears throat> practically nothing much to do to entertain myself for the rest of the flight I think it's time for me now to catch a nap before we make our descent into Dubai so we'll give you a final review as we commence our descent into Dubai so we have begun our descent into Dubai and quickly to sum up our experience on board Air India 787 Dreamliner well the cabin crew excellent the food excellent top notch i would like give it 10 on 10 and uh, the only drawback is the hard product of air india uh, the entertainment system was not working uh, it was broken down unclean tray table and seat uh, broken seats some of them so i think if only air india could improve its hard product and quickly then I think uh, Air India would be a force to reckon with. Everything else has fallen into place. They just need a new planes to come up with. Well, uh, if the news is uh, to be believed, Air India has gone for a refurbishment of all its old aircraft. So uh, let's see, hopefully that refurbishment begins soon and we get to experience that soon. Thank you so much great flight thank you well we have reached dubai and that was a great flight great service great cabin crew and great food uh, if you guys enjoyed that video please don't forget to hit that like share and subscribe button this is meryl from the living jetsara signing off until we see you with many more flight reviews